Hawthorne already believes Zavala abandoned her and the survivors. Now that we're leaving, if we stayed, yes, we could help them survive, but if Zavala really is building a counteroffensive on Titan, we can save them all and take back the city. Vanguard Fleet, Guardian Ship 723 is on approach. We received your beacon and we're ready to join the fight. Guardian Ship, this is Zavala. It's too late. The Hive have overrun Titan. I was wrong to bring us here. Commander, we're here to help. No! We've already lost too many lightless guardians to the Hive. We can't secure this moon. We have our light back. What? Impossible. Commander, if I may. Guardian, this is Deputy Commander Sloan. We have a counter-offensive to plan. To do that, we need to get this station up and running. There's a fleet to prep, guardians to arm, and a trove of intercepted Red Legion transmissions to decrypt. It's critical we gain access to the station's control center. That's where you come in. If the light really is with you, send the hive back to hell. And guardian, please, be careful. Go on, shoot it! What was this place? The golden age cities of Titan were once the pride of humanity. We thought they were abandoned. But I was a fool to think the hive would not spread this far. I have a bad feeling about this.
I have a bad feeling about this. I have a bad feeling about this. The gravity on Titan is approximately 1.352 meters per second squared, except here. These floating rocks must be a residual effect from some hive magic. Okay, Sloan, we can see the control center. Copy that. Keep pushing forward. Commander, at this rate, we can start planning our counteroffensive. We'll be outside the city gates in no time. Hmm. If it were only that simple.
Golden Age console, and a user is still logged in. Leilani Valero, Marine Tech number 426. She was in the middle of logging an emergency of some kind. 